Hello friend, welcome to the channel Pharmacy Dictionary. As per your request, now I am going to re-upload the same topic in English. इसके पहले मैंने इसे हिंदी में already upload किया हुआ है. So in today's video, we are going to study about the mucomycosis, their basic cause, their basic sign and symptom, along with their treatment, management and prevention. See what is a mucomycosis. Right now, right days, there are so many news coming from the media houses that mucomycosis is become one of the dangerous problem for those patients who have recovered from the COVID-19. But is it 100% true? No, it is not completely 100% true. There are few facts which must be known by anyone and everyone. The fact says only those person who have immunocompromised state, who have elevated level of blood sugar level and have continued taken the corticosteroids or different types of other steroids are in a higher risk but not all those patients who have just recovered from the COVID-19 cases so they are major difference between normal recovered person from COVID-19 as well as from those person who have recovered although they are having different type of problem like immunocompromisation elevated blood sugar level and compromised health conditions so they are in higher risk as compared to the normal recovered COVID-19 patient so what are the basic point regarding topic let's start from the beginning what is a mucomycosis this is basically a rare fungal disease but if it untreated that may be very fatal and that may be life-threatening too so why this is the dangerous just because of elevated blood sugar level previously this is known as a zygomycosis now it is known as a mucomycosis but previously zygomasis was the first name it was used to known from now coming to the nature of this as i said this is a fungal disease which is easily available in the atmosphere so how it is get caused it is caused by fungus which is already present in our atmosphere and whenever a person get through the atmospheric condition that is a chance to get inhaled that from the atmosphere toward the respiratory system and once that causing agent that is mold or fungus get entered inside our body that will start to producing its undesirable effect their sign and symptom so it is necessary to find out the important signs and symptoms of this particular disease so how it affect thus by the inhalation now sign and symptoms say what is the difference between sign and symptom signs means those features which are seen in any person but that does not mean and that does not limit to only those symptom which is specific to that particular disease or disorder those symptom may appear in some other disease too but the meaning of symptom says those characteristic feature that is continuously seen on the same patient who is suffering from the mucomycosis that means simply a characteristic features is known as a symptom so what are the basic sign and symptom of this mucomycosis the first one says pain plus redness around the eye and nose the person who is having mucomycosis will feel pain around his face over his eye side and around his nose plate so these are first sign of this mucomycosis second symptom says <coughs> shortness of breath that means a person who is having mucomycosis will not be capable enough to take easy breath that will be a difficulty for taking a breath as compared to the normal individual he or she will feel like heaviness inside the chest while respiration now second one next one is fever fever is the condition where the body temperature get elevated from the normal temperature that is 37 degrees centigrade whenever there is pyrogen and then whenever there is an entry of pyrogen and whenever there is an entry of different types of microorganism it may be virus it may be fungus it may be bacteria or any other type of allergen when they entered inside our body our body's bodyguard that is antibody will start fighting against this antigen so whenever there is a interaction between antigen and antibody there is a elevation in our body temperature and that is simply termed as a fever but you know it very well that fever is not restricted only with case of mucomycosis it is also a symptom of so many normal viral fever along with the covid-19 so it is not guaranteed symptom guaranteed sign that is what not included as a symptoms so what are the basic symptoms these are altered mental state <coughs> 
altered mental state that means a person who is having mucomycosis will not be able to judge any judgmental aspect if you are going to ask him or her that which is better than this two so he or she may not be capable enough to answer you exactly so this is called alteration in mental state next warning symptoms is blood with mucus from nose the, uh, sorry next one is black fungal spot on over the faces as you know it very well the mucomycosis is also known as a black fungal disease so obviously there will be a formation of black spots just because of that particular fungus so black is representing its color that means color of mold and the disease which is caused by fungus that is by complete name is black fungal disease next symptoms are, are uh, altered mental state i have already discussed that we have left the blood with vomiting there is a complete chances of blood while a person get vomit it out so there is a presence of blood in case of vomiting rest are headache and black fungal spores next one is altered mental state blood with mucus from nose there will be a release of mucus from nose and that mucus color will be a black along with some drop of blood next one say local pain on the cheek bone she or he will feel pain inside the cheekbone next one say one sided facial pain numbness also will be there one sided face pain that means it is a face we can divide it into two part left side and right side so there will be chances of facial pain either on the left side or the right side along with the numbness man that means there will be a loss of sensation there will be loss of some pain so this is called numbness which are the characteristic features of mucomycosis coming to the next this is toothache there will be a pain in the tooth and that pain can result into the loosening of the tooth that will be decay of tooth we can say blood or double vision what is the meaning of blood vision blood vision means a vision which is not cleared that is somehow not clear just because of some unknown reason or known reason and in this case of mucomycosis along with the blood vision there will be a vision of double sighted of some person that means a person who is having this kind of problem will see two types of image at the same time that's called double vision now coming to the prevention what is the meaning of prevention prevention are those steps taken earlier than the particular person get affected from the particular disease so the prevention for mucomycosis are mask if you are going to uh, visit any construction site and in construction site there are chances of so many dust and in the that particular dust there are chances of suspension of mucomycosis causing agent molds so if you are not wearing the mask after recovery of covid there is a strong chances of movement of that particular agent via dust and throughout your body will via a respiratory system and you will be get affected so to get prevent from this kind of movement of the particular agent you have to wear a proper mask of three layer surgical mask along with a cotton mask <coughs> next one is says wear shoes you have to wear shoes specifically boots that will prevent you for getting contaminated via soil and long sleeve shirt not t-shirt like this you have to wear a full shirt so that there will be less chances of contact of that particular causing agent with your body part next one say you have to take a bath with lukewarm water once you have come from the site or uh, somehow construction site next one we have to talk about the management management are those process which have to be maintained so that we can restrict that particular disease from being expressed that means we have to control it as minimum as possible it is not exact treatment that is management we have to minimize that progression of particular disease so what are the options the first option say control the diabetes if you are having a uh, blood sugar level higher than the normal value so it is the indication that you are a chance you are in chances of being affected by mucomycosis but i should repeat it once again only those patient who have recovered from the covid 19 and compromised with the immune system along with a high blood sugar level are in danger risk so this is applicable to covid 19 pss only this topic is restricted to covid 19 recovered patient now next one of management is reduce the steroids steroids are basically 
basically prescribed in case of COVID-19 infection. So uh, unethical use must say or we can say the unconcise uh, use, improper use of steroid may decrease your immune system and may increase the chances of being affected from mucomycosis. Next one is you should increase the hydration that means you should drink plenty of water along with oral rehydration salt, ORS salt so that the oral rehydration salt will make you hydrated along with all electrolyte necessary required for your body function so that you may prevent yourself being affected from the mucomycosis. Next one say you should use sterilized water as a humidification or humidifier in oxygen generator or oxygen concentration machine. In case of ICU prolongation we used to use this oxygen concentrator or oxygenator in that case we have to use some water that will humidify so that is act as a humidifier but if you are not replacing that water oftenly then there is chances of growth of mold and that may be contaminated with mucomycosis agent and that is a cause basically so we have to use sterilized water as a humidifier in oxygen generator or oxygen concentrator now coming to the last point that is treatment basically there are two methodology for treatment the first one is by using medicaments the second one is obviously surgery so first one is better than second one first one says actually there are no such information regarding exact medicine available but as per the literature there are two medicine quoted these are amphotericin b and the second one is posoconazole which is a azole derivative under the class of antifungal drug now second and last option for the treatment is surgery in that particular part where the mucomycosis agent get affected or the particular person having the black spot of the mold on over the face has to be removed by surgery then only the spreadation or movability of the particular affected fungal disease can be stopped or can be prevented otherwise day by day that may spread to the other part of the particular part uh, other particular part of that particular patient so these were some basic re information regarding mucomycosis or black fungal disease these are adopted from the ICMR site and all the information provided here is authentic and as it is as mentioned by the Indian government. So that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have cleared some concept regarding the mucomycosis. If you have any doubt, any queries regarding today's topic, you may ask in comment box. I will surely reply your comment. Thank you. Please do take care of yourself.